most likely you are watching this video because your computer is running with some issue here as you are trying to open a program you have recently installed one of these zero ally. The program can start because msvcp100.dll is missing from your computer or the code execution cannot proceed msvcp100.dll was not found. These are the exact same problem and they have the exact same solution as well. Hello everyone, welcome to Tech Evolution. In this very short video, I'll be fixing this error. Before we start, let me thank you for your amazing support in my previous videos. Consider giving me the same support if the video helps you. If you like what you see, don't forget to like and subscribe. Sign up with the intro. Let's get started. The first solution is to download the DLL and place it to the right folders. In order to download the DLL, you need to first go to Google and search for msbcp100.dll. You can choose any result you want. In this case, I'll be choosing the first one. This video is not sponsored, but I'll put the link in the description. You can see if you download options based on the computer architecture and version. If you don't know your computer architecture, click on Start and search for system information. Here you can see mine is a 64-bit PC and I am updated so in this case let's choose the first one I strongly recommend you to read this space it has other fixing method also as the download complete hit open inside the downloaded gif we can see the dll file and a readme file in order to move the dll you need to first open this pc then local Lixi, windows and find a folder name system 32 here it is then click on the downloaded zip drag the msvc 100 dll and drop i have already done this so it is asking me to replace and click on continue if it asks for administrator access before we go ahead let's check by typing the entire file name you can see the file is placed in 32 bit folders so job is done for 32 bit users so you can go and restart your computer this is the summary of the process. This is only applicable if you are a 64-bit user. You need to open this PC one more time. And local Lixi, Windows, and find a folder name syswow64. Then click on the download GIF, drag the image PC for 100 DLL, and drop. I have already done this, so it is asking me to replace and click on continue if it asks for administrator access. Check this one more time. By typing the file name, you can see the file is placed in 64 bit folder as well. And finally, restart your computer. This is the summary of the process. Every computer is different in some special cases. If the error still occurs, you need to go to your favorite browser and search for Microsoft Visual C download. Click on this link and the download will be started. And it's an exe file, you will not have any hassle installing it, and you can read the installer instruction as well. And that's all. If you follow me step by step, you don't have the problem left. Consider giving me super thanks if the video helps you. Connect to, through us our social medias. And do not forget to like and subscribe. Hey, why don't you watch my other videos? Thank you for watching.